Welcome back to Titans All Access. Time for the Nissan Insider portion of our program and our special guest, the head coach of the Titans, Mike Vrabel. Uh, from your TV show, I grabbed your, your keys to the week, and I, I want to get you to expound on them if you would. Key number one, fundamentals in all three phases. Why was it so important to work on that during the box? Well, that's a great opportunity to kind of just not worry about scheme, not worry about an opponent, but focus on ourselves. Like that's that's the, where do we start, right? You have to have some self-improvement. It's got to start with me, the coaching staff, the players. Uh, and so the easiest way to improve uh, right now is on, with, with technique and fundamentals. And yeah, it's okay to play hard and everything else, but at some point in time, you have to rely on your fundamentals uh, pass rush, stopping a run, running the football, blocking, tackling, uh, ball disruption, things that, you know, there's some things that happen in there that have been you know, enough to help us win, but just not enough. And, and, and those things have to continue to show up. All right, key number two, development of younger players. We have, we have some young guys and, and, and maybe they've played, some have, some haven't as much. And uh, some have had to play special teams, and, and when I say younger, it's also newer players, right? Making sure that we, we get Travis Gibson opportunities to, to play for us. Younger or newer or guys that haven't had as many banked reps through the, the course of the first six weeks. All right, your third key on your TV show was better understanding for overall concepts. It, it's it's not enough to, to go and, and play hard. You have to have an idea of what's going on around you. Uh, we have to do our job, but I think that there's, for us to improve and, and win consistently, everybody out there uh, has to understand what everybody else's job is and how they function within the play. And if something breaks down, are, are we good enough? And, and we have to be good enough to make up for something else that somebody else does, whether that's on a punt coverage, see a guy here, go there. His job was to set the edge. I'm gonna now go set the edge. He's gonna fill in offensively. The play is designed to, for a double team and a kick out, and we're gonna have to make sure that those are things that happen. I'm just using those as an example, but having a, a greater understanding of, of what's going on around us in the design. You mentioned that you talked with the team about what you have to do to win, what the 2023 Titans must do to win. How do you get that across? Examples? Well, I mean, you try to show it, you practice it. I mean, you show them when we don't, you show them when we turn the ball over, you show when we have self-inflicted wounds in the red zone. I mean, just astronomical yardage lost in the red zone by just mistakes. And you know, if they beat us, they beat us. If we give it to them, shame on us. First and 20, second and 17s, third and 17s. Like, I, Th those are just bad yardages to, to try to live with and it's throughout and it's something different each time and, and then obviously when we can be efficient down there you know we've had an opportunity to score some touchdowns those are things that you can't do and try to explain to them you know we, we have to hit the quarterback more than three times in two games create turnovers and yet you remain very optimistic about this football team why well because i know the guys that we have on here i know the people in this building I know that our staff uh, throughout the organization, I believe in it. Uh, you know, we just have to do some things a little better and, and not, not beat ourselves. Coach, enjoy the weekend. Thanks for joining us. Appreciate it. Mike Vrabel, our Nissan Insider on this edition of Titans All Access. We're back in the BetMGM studio right after this.